my little chickens. Look at all these poor, disgusting peasants. Join me, boys and girls. There have been quite enough talk in the story of Jack and his magic theme song. Hello, boys and girls. How are we all tonight? Yay! Oh dear. I had about as much enthusiasm as a sack of my mum's potato. Shall we try that again? I said, how are we all today? Yay! Slightly more coherent. We'll try it one more time for good luck. How are we all today? Yay! Now, my name is Tilly Tally Trot, and I live here in the local dairy with my son Jack and our cow Pat, and we're very happy, but we're very poor. Aww. We're so poor, I have to search out the back of Tesco's just for scraps of food to eat. Well, every little helps. <laughs> We're so poor, I can't afford proper shoes. I live a soulless existence. <laughs> We're so poor, bits and pieces keep falling off my house. It's semi-detached. <laughs> <laughs> I have a message from the giant as follows. <coughs> Get milking! And don't stop! until there's enough milk for the giant's breakfast for a week. For a week? Oh, no. You heard me. One week's worth of milk, or you'll all be on the giant's dinner plate before you can say, hungry. <laughs> oh, Jack. I think I'm going to need your help. What would you like me to do, Mum? I'm all ears. I need you to help me milk it. So what would you like me to do? Milk it. Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Are you sure you're sure? Yes, I'm sure. I'm sure. Are you sure you're sure you're sure you're sure? Yes, I'm sure. What are you doing? We're milking it. Oh, for goodness <laughs> sake. Well, stop that and make something useful of yourself. Better. Welcome to my dairy. This place is the pride of my heart. Ew, what a brilliant bunch of cows. I had no idea we had so many. Oh, not a bunch, a herd. Heard of what? Herd of cows. Of course I've heard of cows. Oh, yes, oh, yes. Oh, fuck. Is that getting the target? That's quite good. Yeah. Oh, what? I'm sorry. Sorry. Oh. Stand right there. Keep still. I can't that's the idea. Now, next we've got to wash it off. Shall I, girls and boys? No! Are you no. sure? No! Count with me then. One, no. two, three. No. How's that on your udder? Mother, how can there be a... 
A massive beanstalk in our garden. What did you do? It must be the beans. I told you they're magic. Can well, I have them all day? The giant wants his dinner. Let us go, you creep. Shut it, you ungrateful wench. You're not the one who's about to be made into a giant-sized beef burger. You will leave her alone, you slimy you. Spike. You are. <laughs> and if you're not careful, I'll put you through the mincer very slowly. So come on, you two. It's gone Whoa. dinner time. Hi-ho, <laughs> Tilly! Mum, was that you in the helicopter? Yes. I went up to Dunk as well because I thought I could catch a flight up to meet you. I wasn't going to climb the beanstalk, they'd have seen right up my skirt. When I got there, there was a helicopter ready and waiting, and there was a lovely looking man inside. So I strapped myself to him, and then when we got above Sidmouth, we jumped out. So why did it crash? Well, you know the man I strapped myself to? Yes. He was the pilot. <laughs> You're lucky to be in one place. Oh, don't worry, he gave me a soft landing. <laughs> Girls and boys, are you telling me porky pies? No. Are you sure? It's behind you. It's behind me now. Yeah. Oh dear! Right, there's only one thing for it. I've got to turn around and face my fears. But will you count with me? Yeah. Oh, good. Right, one, two, three.
said and done. You've climbed the beanstalk to the sky. And my true love's heart I've uh, won. We've had our ups and downs today. But well, we're all best of friends now. Old Teddy Trot has gained a daughter. The poor old stupid girl. girl. <laughs> we've reached the end, you've all been fab. And that's the end of that. So I hope you've enjoyed our story of, of the, the Trots and a Cow Named Pat. Believe, I 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 believe,